Leaders of the political parties have been expressing their sympathy and sorrow at the tragedy. The parties were today focusing on financial and educational initiatives while Sinn Féin launched its election manifesto. A sombre start to the Fine Gael news conference this morning. Could I, in respect of those who have lost their lives, ask everybody please to stand for a moment's silence to their memory. Thank you. Enda Kenny said the prayers of the whole country are with those who lost their lives. Fine Gael was launching its fiscal plan, which they say is about less waste, lower taxes and stronger growth. Fine Gael says it's the only party with low tax economic plans. Enda Kenny said his proposals would restart the economy. His finance spokesman contrasted the tax burden it would impose with Fianna Fáil and in particular Labour. So Labour has mo have moved dramatically now and uh, they're certainly becoming a seriously high tax party, particularly on the income tax side. Their position has moved a couple of times, but they're talking about a marginal rate of tax now, 55%. The Fine Gael plan would see no increase in income tax rates, a 1% hike in the standard rate of VAT, but a temporary cut in the low rate for a labour-intensive industry, and the retention of full tax relief for pensioners. Michael Noonan insisted it didn't represent auction politics. Later, he clashed with Fianna Fáil over Brian Lenehan's decision to put off extra recapitalisation for the banks, which he'd initially welcomed yesterday. My reaction at, at five o'clock was uh, that a decision had been taken with full agreement between the government and the IMF, the ECB and the Commission. I don't believe that anymore. Uh, I'm of the view now that uh, this was motivated by you know, the desire to have a political stroke.